Have you ever wondered what goes on behind the curtains of a grand show? Step into the world of extravagant performances and dazzling spectacles with The Great Ziegfeld, a movie that brings to life the legendary showman's journey to fame. Follow his rise to prominence, from humble beginnings to the pinnacle of show business. But beware, there's more to this story than meets the eye. Stay tuned for a roller coaster of emotions as we uncover funny, shocking, and sad facts about the characters and events portrayed. Now, let me ask you out of the many roles in this movie, which one was your favorite? Or perhaps you're curious about lesser known facts or anecdotes that fascinate you. Feel free to share your thoughts and questions below. We'd love to hear your stories and memories related to this movie. So keep watching and don't forget to leave your comments. Let's dive deeper into the world of The Great Ziegfeld. A groundbreaking film from 1936 showcased the flamboyant life of a Broadway legend. Audiences were mesmerized by the extravagant stage productions and innovative showmanship portrayed in the movie. Its success sparked various adaptations, from stage shows to TV specials, and even collectible items like posters became popular among fans. This film's portrayal of a visionary entertainer has left a lasting mark on how show business is depicted in popular culture. Its depiction of glamour and spectacle continues to captivate audiences, ensuring its place as a timeless classic in cinema history. In the realm of entertainment, a certain movie has left its mark that continues to resonate. The actors in this film, known for their comedic brilliance, were honored for their contributions, underscoring their pivotal roles in its success. Their on-screen chemistry delighted audiences and showcased seamless collaboration, navigating the nuances of their roles with dynamic energy. What adds depth to this narrative is that it stands as the sole directorial achievement of a certain individual to clinch the top accolade at the Academy Awards. This unique accomplishment speaks volumes about the director's artistry and the impact of the movie on the cinematic landscape. The director's vision and the collective effort of the cast and crew converged to create a masterpiece that exceeded expectations. In essence, the movie not only showcased the brilliance of its stars, but also captured a moment in cinematic history that continues to captivate audiences. Its recognition at the Academy Award serves as a testament to its lasting influence and artistic merit, immortalizing it as a hallmark in film history. This cinematic gem, blending talent and vision harmoniously, has left an unmistakable impression on the canvas of entertainment, a legacy that captivates audiences to this day. In the 1936 movie, the great Ziegfeld Frank Morgan landed a role that was initially considered for W.C. Fields in The Wizard of Oz. Myrna Loy, born in Helena, was delivered in a hospital, hinting at her family's prosperity in sparsely populated Montana. Interestingly, a cast of her handprint and signature adorns the sidewalk in front of Theater 80 on St. Mark's Place in New York City. These tidbits offer insights into the actors' lives and careers, enriching the tapestry of Hollywood history. In a famous movie collaboration, Myrna Loy's appearance is delayed until 2 hours and 15 minutes into the film. She plays the role of Florence Ziegfeld's former wife in this soft biopic. Behind the scenes, there was some disagreement about Loy's casting. Billy Burke, also linked to Ziegfeld, felt overlooked as Loy was chosen instead of her. This caused tension during production. However, Loy's performance proved her talent, despite the initial discord. This backstage drama added depth to the film story. The production of A Pretty Girl is Like a Melody in The Great Ziegfeld was no small feat. It's reported that the set for this iconic scene took months to construct and cost over $200,000. Surprisingly, this expenditure exceeded what Florence Ziegfeld Jr. spent on an entire show. Former Ziegfeld girl Doris even revealed this startling fact. In terms of recognition, the great Ziegfeld stood out, winning the Best Picture Oscar in 1936, among other notable nominations for its cast members like Frank Morgan. Morgan, known for his roles in other classics like The Wizard of Oz, collaborated with the real Billy Burke, adding to the movie's depth. This blend of talent and spectacle made the great Ziegfeld a cinematic achievement worth remembering. In the year 1936, a significant film emerged featuring notable actors of that era. One of them had their life story chronicled in the Scribner Encyclopedia of American Lives. The first volume of this encyclopedia, spanning from 1981 to 1985, provides insights into his life. In another instance, a prominent figure found recognition in a video game, showcasing her lasting influence in popular culture. The last survivor from a beloved classic movie of 1939 also played a memorable role in the 1936 film, adding depth to his contribution to the entertainment industry. These three individuals, each leaving a distinct mark, played crucial parts in the stories they were involved in, 
leaving a lasting impression that still resonates today. In the realm of classic cinema, there's a tale that stands tall, weaving together the glitz of showbiz with the complexities of human relationships. This story delves into the lives of its characters, drawing viewers into a world where love and fame collide in a whirlwind of emotions. It's a narrative that resonates with audiences, leaving a lasting impression on those who are touched by its enchantment. Within this cinematic gem, a cast of characters navigates the highs and lows of their intertwined destinies. Amidst the sparkle of Broadway lights, one luminary shines brightly, captivating audiences with her performance. Her journey, marked by love and heartache, mirrors the ebb and flow of real-life relationships, adding depth to the story's authenticity. As the plot unfolds, viewers are transported to a world where dreams are chased, hearts are broken, and the human spirit prevails against all odds. It's a testament to the power of storytelling, a reminder of the magic that can be found within the confines of a darkened theater. In the end, this cinematic masterpiece leaves an impression that lingers long after the credits roll. It's a reminder of the beauty of love, the allure of fame, and the resilience of the human soul. And as the curtains close, one thing remains certain the impact of this timeless tale will endure for generations to come. In 2015, memorabilia belonging to Louise Reiner, one of the stars of the movie, were auctioned, fetching a total of $489.69 for her heirs. Myrna Loy, another prominent figure in the film, shared the screen with William Powell a total of 14 times throughout their careers, including their roles in The Great Ziegfeld. Fanny Bryce, after giving birth to her son William, promptly resumed work to perform in the Broadway production of Ziegfeld Follies of 1921. These actors played pivotal roles in the production, contributing to its enduring legacy. In the old days of Hollywood, some actors took interesting paths to stardom. For instance, Frank Morgan, who played Professor Marvel's wizard in a famous movie, also appeared in The Great Ziegfeld. He shared the screen with other big stars of his time. Suzanne Karn had a chance to be in The Ziegfeld Follies, but she said no when she was young because her parents didn't approve. Myrna Loy, another iconic actor, started her career by doing live shows at Grauman's Egyptian Theater in Los Angeles. These shows helped her get noticed before she starred in big movies like The Ten Commandments and The Thief of Baghdad. These stories show how different actors made their way in Hollywood, each leaving a unique mark on its history. In The Great Ziegfeld, Frank Morgan portrayed the wizard in a heartfelt manner that resonated with viewers. Margaret Hamilton, known for her role as the Wicked Witch in The Wizard of Oz, revealed that Morgan's on-screen generosity mirrored his real-life persona, bringing her to tears during certain scenes. Nat Pendleton, not Carl Dane, assumed the role of the chef in Crazy House. As for Mickey Daniels, he shared the screen with his father, Richard Daniels, in the Our Gang shorts, alongside appearances in Harold Lloyd's features. Additionally, Mickey's brother Leonard contributed to Roach Studios' transportation department for over two decades. Such familial connections enriched both Mickey's personal and professional life, shaping his journey in the entertainment industry.